I thought it'd be fun to do another palette project, so I picked up a few. They're drink coasters made from real palettes and made to look like little palettes. It's the whole palette circle of life. I'm gonna use these palette slats for the slats on the coasters, and I wanna keep the scale fairly accurate, so what I need to do is thin these down. Rather than using my planer, I'm gonna use my belt sander, but only on one side, because I wanna retain all of the imperfections and aged look of the palette. Okay, I can tell this is just gonna take forever to do it this way, <laughs> so I'm gonna try the planer. I've set up a feather board here that is 3 8 of an inch from my blade. That way I can run, run one strip through and then just keep moving my fence over so they'll all be the same width. I'm gonna cut these strips down to three and a half inch lengths using my miter box. I don't need to plane down the boards for the bottom runners, and I just need to cut them to the same width as the top slats. These pieces are all four inches long, and I only need two for each pallet. A lot of pallets have this kind of a cutout on the bottom runner, so I wanna create that on these little pieces. In order to do that safely, I'm gonna hot glue it to another board. I've drawn two marks to indicate where I need to start and stop this cut. And that piece will just break off of there. Any excess glue just comes off by heating it back up again and then you can just peel it off. What I want to do is find the worst looking pieces to be visible and the better looking pieces to be on the underside. I've got a square that should help me keep these aligned and just roughly set these up. I know I want to go four inches across. Now these are the pieces that I cut out on the router. Now here I'm taking just a little bit of artistic liberty and putting eight of these slats on the pallet. It, real pallets usually seem to have about 11. I'm finishing these with a coat of spar urethane that I used on my other outdoor pallet project. This should seal in the dirt that's on this pallet wood. <laughs> And it'll also protect it from moisture. So if you use a pallet to make a pallet, is it recycling or upcycling? I think I'll call it side cycling. <laughs> As always, if you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have new woodworking videos every Friday. And visit my website, woodworkingformeremortals.com. And I'll see you next week.